If you're looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 21 coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and their coins are currently discounted a ton. Make sure to take advantage and use code Poodle at checkout for an additional 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we got a ton of stuff to go over. We got make rights. We got my Mutt rewards that I haven't opened yet that I saved for today's video. We got new LTDs, and we got some updates as per usual. Now, the make, or, the make rights, guys, super awesome. For all you guys who were asking last week about the Kawan short, everyone who opened, so if anyone who opened packs during the Kawan short incident where he wasn't really in packs and people were opening packs, you do get all those packs back, as well as a chance to actually pull those packs and get Kwan short in those packs. So pretty much whatever packs you get back as make right packs will have Kwan short in them. Not that you're guaranteed to pull them, but there will be a pull rate within them for that Kwan short. So you're not you're probably not gonna get him, but there may be increased odds for it. It could be interesting. As well as I mean he's not a crazy price anymore, but still still don't think you pull regardless. But yeah, so there is make rights. I know they were very quiet about that, which sucks. September 24th, it's been exactly like a week. They've just been quietly and hasn't said anything, which kind of sucks. A lot of people are really pissed off about that. But at least they are giving us some make rights and going over that today. So if you do start seeing some packs pop up, they say it could be anywhere between 11 uh, a.m. Eastern time to 2 p.m. Eastern time. So stay tuned. It could be anywhere for the next three, four hours. So just kind of just be on the lookout checking. Now, of course, guys, for the Poodle Squad today, make sure you guys are down below. Like the video, turn on that noti bell, and comment down below Poodle Squad. And of course, be subscribed. Once you do all those things, you will have a chance to be shouted out. Now, for today's Poodle Squad shout out, guys, is Noel, Noah Carlson. Shout out to you, man, for showing support in each and every video. Thank you so much. Appreciate you for showing some support. Again, guys, keep it up. Keep commenting down below Poodle Squad, and I will get to all of you guys eventually. But, guys, moving on from that. Let's go over the make rights. Let's check everything out. Of course, the updates are always interesting as well. I'm super excited for these LTDs. It's our Thursday LTDs, which honestly, I still don't know what the theme of these LTDs really are. Like if they're Thursday night football, which obviously they're not. We've kind of come to the conclusion that those teams aren't. So I don't know what to call it anymore. Is it just signature series-esque? Don't really know. But LTDs are cool nonetheless. But guys, head on over to the make rights. Check any coins to pick up any of these LTDs. Make sure to head on over to Mutt Reserve down below in the description. Everything's discounted right now. You can buy the LTDs directly on the site, which is even cheaper and safer way than buying coins. You can either, or you can buy coins, or you can buy training, or anything else you need in there. Coins are discounted, training's discounted, and the players. Make sure to use code Poodle for an additional 15% off your order. So here's the blog post. Hey, Madden Ultimate Team community. Last Thursday, September 24th, when the limited editions were released, we received reports from players that limited edition Kawan Short was not in packs. After further investigation, the Madden team identified the issue and introduced the player item in packs. The impact time period for when Kawan Short was not in packs was 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time to 12.40 p.m. Eastern Time on Thursday, September 24th. The Madden Ultimate Team will be sending out make right packs today, October 1st, around 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Eastern Time to address this issue. Any player that opened a pack during the impact time frame that should have been eligible to pull a limited time Kawan Short will receive the packs they opened as a make right. These specific make right packs will have the chance to pull a limited edition Kawan Short. So pretty much, guys, if you opened up 10 Getty Golds, you will receive back 10 Getty Golds within that time period, of course. If you opened up Legend Fantasy Packs, which weren't even there, or Elite Packs, or Gridiron Packs, or All Pro Fantasy Packs, any of those, you will now get those back. Like, if you open 10, you get 10. You open 5, you get 5. Pretty much just replicate. You pretty much get all those backs back free. Packs back free. And then go ahead and open them again. Now, again, you could save that if you'd like. I don't know how it works. If those packs only pull things from that time period, I really don't know how that works. But I do know you have a chance to go on short again. We do apologize if we're unable to message this information sooner, but the Madden Ultimate Team needs to investigate the number of impacted users and the final plan for the make right. Going forward, we will work to message out this information sooner. Thank you again for your continued patience and understanding the Madden Ultimate Team team. Great. Great news. I'm happy they did it. I'm not happy they did it a week later because they do realize these packs are less valuable, right? Because Kwan Short that day went for more than Kwan Short right now. Kind of sucks in that aspect. We've had series two market crashes. We're kind of it's not the, it's not the same. Now, is it cool that we get a double packs? Kind of because technically you're getting double pulls, so I guess it evens out in some aspect. But guys, about it for that. Let's head on over to the LTDs and the updates. Guys, before we do check out the stats, though, I do want to open up my Mutt Rewards pack as well as go ahead and try my luck with pulling the LTD. I never really opened packs for them, but you know what? I need my first LTD pull. I still don't have it. I honestly thought I would have had it by now. I've seen people get out of the Good Morning Madden pack, so I have I have faith in these packs a little bit more now. But we do have my All Pro uh, Madden tier rewards. So let's see. We got Team of the Week packs, Week Three, two of them. I don't know what the odds of these packs are, but maybe we can pull something crazy out of here. All right, we got Alden Smith. We got NFL 100. All right, 81 Walter Jones, not bad. We get a oh my lord. Okay, I don't I don't know what the animation is for a big one. 79 Dietrich. Well, Wise Jr., that sucks. Darnell Savage. Darnell Savage is a budget piece, though, so don't sleep on him. But, all right, our final pack here until we get into some paid packs. So, let's see. Okay, there's our Team of the Week player. 
83 Xavier Rhodes, that's not too hot. Wow. You know, I don't know why I get excited for Mutt Rewards anymore. I, every time, it's just... It's, I, I feel like Mutt Reward Packs are literally, like, completely nerfed to the point where you can't pull anything out of them. Because that's kind of just what's always happened for me here. Alright, let's see. What do we got? What packs we got in store right now? We got... Okay, that doesn't look too hot. That doesn't look too hot. Alright. I want an all-pro fantasy pack. Those, we don't have all-pro fantasy packs? Ooh, what do I open then? I'll open a few get -a goals And just in case, there's make right some. I mean, people have pulled them out of get a gold before, so... Okay, team of the week right there. I'll take that. 82 overall Chris Jones. I guess that's decent. I'll open up like three of these, and then we'll get into the stats. I mean, I'm just, I am gotta test my luck every day, I guess, right? Take Test my luck. See if I can pull anything literally ever. I don't understand how I have such bad luck. I mean, I pulled good things. I just never pulled that card. You know what I mean? Like, I pulled 2 million coins in that Vic Pack opening by pulling five or six of the top set pieces, but I never pulled that card, like... That glitchy LTD pool. I make coins. I just... I don't know what it is. All right. Final one here. Just want to see a big flash. Nope. Okay, I'm going to open up one more, actually. One more real quick for the video. And let's see. It's ridiculous. I don't understand how long I can go without getting any of this stuff. <sighs> Another gold. All right. There goes that. Thank you, The Yard, for giving me XP. Let's go check out these cards on the block. Clearly, today is not my day in terms of that. Guys, we do have the make rights, though. So, for all you guys, we should have more packs later at some point. For all you guys who did end up opening packs, we do have this. Let's go check this out real quick. And, of course, I have a Marvel Rewards pack. Uh, let's see, 92 to 90. No, it's not that overall. It's 91. Hopefully, they're on the block. They're never on the block just yet. Usually, they take quite a while, which really kind of annoying, actually. Which always makes us, which always leads us to believe they're not even in packs yet. Because that's kind of Madden specialty here. So, let's go check it out. And I do not see them up yet. So, let's start with the Micah Hyde stats over here. 91 overall free safety Micah Hyde. Looks like one of the best safeties in the game. 90 speed, 90 excel, 82 tackle. 93 play rec, 87 pursuit, 88 man coverage, 93 zone coverage, and 58 hit power. Yes, he has no hit power, but being above 90 zone does make him an elite coverage corner uh, free safety. And he could also honestly probably play a little bit corner as well. Whereas like a nickel, a nickel corner. He's gonna look, he's gonna be really good. Now, guys, if you do power him up, I did test this out over here. If I do power him up all the way to an 89 overall, just a power up card, that's it. He still gets to I believe a 92 zone coverage. So you don't even need to really you don't even need to get the LTD to make him good. He'll have an 89 speed. But in my opinion, if you have to go Atwater or Hyde, if you want to get that zone with Micah Hyde, that's really not the worst idea. He's going to be like a Tyron Matthew, but a bit faster. So I'm probably going to end up running him and Tyron Matthew. I have a super, super great coverage safety duo there. Although I do take I do take Tyron down to the box as well. But he looks super, super solid, guys. And of course, chemmed up and everything with the full LTD. You do get him up, powered up to a 91 speed. He gets like a 97 play rep, which is insane. He gets to a 97 zone, which is crazy. And a 91 man, 92 man. Card's crazy. He's gonna have it powered up on the LTD. He's gonna be crazy. If you just power him up regular, he'll get like he'll still be crazy though. If he gets like a 91, 92 zone on zone, he'll still get high up there. And his man coverage, I believe, gets to like what was it? Gets like an 85, 84. So of course you won't get it on that one. But still, still great regardless. All I really care about is the zone. But not bad at all. I do like this Micah High card a lot. I'm probably gonna end up powering him up. Although I don't know if I'll actually end up picking up the full LTD. At least this series. But I'll for sure go ahead. And try to take advantage of his power-up card. Now we're back up on the block now. So Mike High's going for a mill. And then we got Amari Cooper, who's actually pretty exciting. Let's go check him out. Amari Cooper, wide receiver for the Cowboys. 89 speed, 87 jumping, 88 catching, 86 catching traffic, 86 spec catch, 91 short running, 89 medium route running, and 88 deep route running. So he's going to get every route running threshold. When you power him up, he's going to have a 92 short running. He's going to have a 90 medium route running. And with go deep, he won't up above a 90 deep route running. So he's going to be... Probably the most well-rounded route runner in the game with a 90 speed as well as an 88 jumping, 89 catching, 87 catch and traffic, and probably 90 spec catch after go deep and everything. So this card is going to be perfect for the meta right now of beating man press and everything with his route running. Let's see what his release is. That's important. So change of direction is 90, which is really good. His jukes in 88, that's solid. His release. Where is it? Where is it? Why am I not seeing it here? Not seeing release or beat press, or any of that stuff. I don't know where it is, but. Regardless, looks super good. He's going to be a top route runner in the game. He's going to fall slightly short on the catch and traffic threshold, which is kind of annoying. But he's going to have the spec catch threshold. So he's not going to be the most crazy catcher, but he's going to have the speed and route running separation. He's going to be like a faster Jerry Rice. He's pretty much a better faster Jerry Rice. And I believe a bit taller and maybe the same height. So Mark Cooper is super, super solid. Both these cards are really good today, honestly. I really like both of them. Now, of course, Micah Hyde's cool because you only have to power him up. You don't have to actually go ahead and try to get his card. 
for the most part you can just power him up and use his 89 he's gonna be super solid regardless but amari cooper big fan of this card again i don't know if i can justify the price but guys, that is about it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you aren't to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Uh, make sure to go down below. Come join the Poodle Squad. Shout out to Noah Carlson. Noah Carlson for being a part of the Poodle Squad, man. Thank you so much for your support. And if you guys want a chance to be shouted out, like the video, comment down below, let me know, say Poodle Squad, and turn the, um, of course, like the video as well. And guys, real quick, if you guys do need coins to pick up any of these LTDs, they are really, really good. I recommend you go scoop some of these up. Um, head on to my reserve down below. Use code Poodle. Coins are discounted. You can buy these players directly on my reserve as well. You want to avoid the whole reduction of coins you can buy them on there you can buy coins you can buy training anything you want it's all discounted right now if you use code poodle you get an additional 15 percent off good luck boys i'm out Peace.